I had a great day of model airplane flying today. I started out with slope soaring because I had a north wind which I need for my slope, but uh, it was only about 30 degrees. The, the 1S batteries, they don't seem to like that cold weather and sometimes they want to stop uh, the, driving the motor that is. I flew my electric Taylor craft. This is the old electric model that originally had started out with NICADs and a brush motor and this year I added lithium batteries and a brushless motor and it flies really well. I have a lot of fun doing touch and goes with it. Uh, it's fun to take off and land with a tail dragger. I'm not completely satisfied how this plane flies. I think maybe it needs a little more weight in the nose. It just seems like it's kind of twitchy in the air and when you come to land it is too. So I'm going to try a bigger battery and get it up farther in the nose. But it, it flies pretty well. This is a 1300 milliamp battery. I think this plane originally had struts on the wings too and I don't have those so I take it pretty easy and I haven't done any loops yet. My electric sailplane and this had started out with NICAD batteries and a brush motor and here a few years ago I ch changed to brushless and lithium batteries and it made one heck of a difference. This thing climbs darn near straight up. Most of the time I only climb at about three quarters throttle. The lift was pretty good today. It seemed like the thermals were kind of narrow and you had to circle real tight to stay in the lift. And it seems a lot of times that I was getting in the sun when I was in lift. So I was blocking with the transmitter. Today I was really doing the landings well, landing right close to myself. It seems like when I'm in a contest I can't land anywhere near the tape, but uh, when I'm out sport flying it seems pretty easy. I guess you're just so relaxed. Well, after this I did some free flight uh, hand launch glider with a Thermic 20. It's the Jetco version. And I had some pretty good flights with that.